Blackpink's Rosé's A PT, opposed by Malaysian Health Ministry, ongoing controversy. On the 25th, the Malaysian Ministry of Health analyzed the lyrics of Rosé and Bruno Mars's duet APT through their official Facebook account, asking, Have you heard the catchy song Apartment Apartment? The health authorities specifically pointed out the lines, Kissy face, kissy face, sent to your phone, but I'm trying to kiss your lips for real, and turn this apartment into a club. I'm talking drink, dance, smoke, freak, party all night. They expressed concern that using the term apartment in a seductive context contradicts Eastern cultural values. They warned that the song's frequent use as background music in social media videos could inadvertently become part of daily life, allowing children to memorize the lyrics without understanding the message. The ministry emphasized the need for parents, educators, and the community to be more cautious and sensitive to the increasingly unfiltered influence of Western culture. Malaysia, where Islam is the state religion and 60% of the population is Muslim, has a cultural context where alcohol is strictly prohibited among Muslims, regardless of sect. While some agreed with the health authorities that songs are becoming increasingly inappropriate, the majority of locals reacted with disbelief. Comments on the post included sentiments like, people just want to enjoy the melody, should we just live in caves? And anyone taking this seriously should get a brain scan. As reported by Singaporean entertainment media, eight days. On the other hand, some have alleged similarities between APT and a 2013 song by Japanese singer Sawai Miku. However, industry experts have dismissed these claims explaining that the resemblance lies in widely used chords that are prevalent across many genres of music. Unlike melody or rhythm, which could indicate more intentional replication, chord progressions are often similar in numerous songs, making the plagiarism accusations unfounded. Additionally, AI-generated songs mimicking APT have surfaced to bolster these accusations, sparking further criticism. Netizens commented, People just want to tear down success. And, These claims are baseless and petty. Since its release on October 18th, APT has achieved numerous milestones, including being the first by a female Korean soloist to top the US Spotify chart and leading the global Spotify Daily Top Songs chart. The pre-release single adds to the anticipation for Rosé's full solo album, set to drop on December 6th. 